Spider fans, win four courtside seats to a home game, a spider prize package, and lunch for four with Coach Mooney at Outback Steakhouse, all from Farm Bureau Insurance. Register online now at spidercontest.com. We've really embraced it, and we've even embraced the fact that we hadn't won. So um, it, it is good. It's significant. I, I think it's great that we have this rivalry. I think it's great that they're two very good programs, 10 minutes apart. Um, and for us, we, we, needed, we needed to win a game uh, in the rivalry and in the series. So uh, yeah, it, it, may, it means a little bit more. Um, and we have great respect for the, for the program they are and uh, what they're doing. Uh, so there's no bitterness there. Just that it was, uh, you know, it's it's not easy, not easy not winning. Oh, thrilled for Justin. I mean, he's such a good player. You know, I mean, the things he can do. You know, he had that offensive rebound and put back in the first half, and the, the, the same guy could shoot such a beautiful jump shot. The next possession is, it's just amazing. And uh, Justin is, it's undeniable. He's one of the very best players around, and I, I just haven't seen many guys as as versatile as he is as he is at his size uh, who can have that much of an impact on a game. That's, that was huge. I think uh, they're an excellent three-point shooting team. And before tonight, they had been starting four three-point shooters, and something that gives any kind of team's problems. And we were really focused on defending the three-point line and uh, did a good job. They had a, they had a couple, like anybody will, that didn't go in early. Uh, but for the most part, I thought we really made it hard for them to score, especially from three-point range. I think so. I mean, I, like, like anybody, I probably wish we had brought the game home a little bit more smoothly, you know, with foul shooting and whatnot. But... That's a difficult position to be in. We're up by so many points, and we, we want to continue to be aggressive, but we don't want you know we don't want to um, be so aggressive that we start to lose or that we don't lose enough time off the clock. So, yeah, I think it is good that we have a break. Uh, I think this is a, an emotional game, an exciting game, and I think it's good that we have a little bit of time here to, to have our day off tomorrow, get our guys ready for their finals, and then uh, just start thinking about Georgia Tech later in the week. He's much more consistent, um, and I think. Well, I think a number of reasons. I think it comes with his confidence as that has grown over the years. Um, I also think he, he's had a problem with foul trouble, uh, which he has continued this year, but not quite as bad as it, as it has been. And it's hard to be consistent when you're on the bench. And he's learned a little bit how to play with fouls. Um, you know, he has worked extremely hard. I think that has something to, do, something to do with it, too. He's worked really, really hard on his game and his body and has become a tremendous player who, who is much more consistent. I thought the atmosphere was great. I thought right from the beginning of the game, uh, you know, that's what college basketball is all about. That's what, why everybody's interested, and um, it was great. Very emotional. I thought, you know, we went up, jumped up seven nothing. It was loud. It was loud throughout the game, and the home court plays a huge part in it. Uh, there, there's just no question about it. The home court is, you know, I don't know how many points it's worth, but it, it's worth a lot, and it just gives you so much energy and and emotion. And uh, it, 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 for for us tonight, it was huge. Well, this is this is that's what it is. It's an opportunity. In the summer, we plan to schedule the very best schedule we can possibly put together, and you know that includes VCU, Old Dominion, and uh, our rivals in, in the in in Virginia. And we also want to play the best that the country has to offer, and, and we, we try not to shy away from anybody. And uh, it's 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 really good for us, and it's especially good for us if we can continue to be successful. Once once that jump ball goes up, man. Like you think it's another game, but it's it's so much more emotion and energy in, into you know this rap, this rivalry. No matter where we're at, you know the black and blue classic. It's just it's just, a, it's just great energy out there throughout the whole game. You know both teams want it real bad, playing real hard, and you know it's just a great thing to see. Can you talk about the crowd? Oh yeah, the crowd. Um, I felt like we had a great great turnout. You know, um, you know VCU had a lot of fans in there as well, but you know all all of our fans did a great job. Just having and bringing that energy, you know, really helping us out, going out there in the first half and, you know, really jumping on those guys. I don't really gauge it like that. I just gauge on how, how we come out and compete, you know. I feel like um, as a team, we really came out there and showed that we were a better team tonight and a uh, better team this year. And, you know, it just re really feels good to, you know, take care of that and really say that, you know, we beat VCU this year and, you know, this is our last go around at me and Kay as seniors and it just really feels great. I mean, we came out with a lot of energy. Um, we were real focused on the defense end, trying to get rebounds, uh, not only play defense on our man and keep our man in front of him, but finish the defense, uh, defensive playoff with the rebound. And uh, I think it was our energy that caused us to be so focused in on defense. Yeah, definitely. Um, Justin's been unbelievable this year, getting all our big rebounds. I mean, making, stepping up as a scorer, being aggressive. I mean, doing everything that we need him to do out there. 
I mean, he takes so much pressure off of me because I don't have to try to score every time. I can kick it out to him knowing that he's going to hit the three or throw it to him in the post when we need an easy bucket and things have been hard. Throw it to him in the post and he's going to hit the fade and it's going to go in. So, I mean, offensively he's been great and defensively he's been great too. Oh, yeah, I really want to get this win just for our seniors, Kevin and Hart. I know they, they haven't beat him the whole career, so it's really important for me to like, get, get that win for them because, I mean, we really want this win pretty bad. So. Feels great. Uh, I mean, my main role is to play defense, make sure my man doesn't score on me, and just talk on defense, be a big presence on defense, and rebound as much as I can. And on um, offense, just run the offense, and when I get an opportunity, you just take it. What about the rest of your teammates, uh, Darian and those guys? What's Darian, I'm saying, just be good on defense, every possession, rebound, and take, take the good shots on offense. Well, in the offseason, I just worked on, you know, Shots that I would get in the offense and just being more comfortable shooting. I shot a, I shot a lot and I, I really worked on my post game. You know, I, I was able to work out with some guys over the summer and just kind of focusing on that, just being more confident catching it in the post, you know, making the right decisions and just doing doing everything I can, you know, and just being more aggressive, going after rebounds, being solid defensively, just being a great all-around player is what I wanted to focus in on.